Hello, hello, hello. Gareth Naylor here, watercolour landscape artist, and I'm still doing my 50 watercolour sketches of Spain. And now this is number eight, and this is a street, I think, in Valencia. So Valencia is a really beautiful Spanish city, especially this part, the old part. And uh, this was my first painting. And what I like about this one is the light. So above that building, that beautiful glow, I'm so happy with that. I think that worked really well. And also the uh, color, the subtle colors of the buildings works really well. And these little gaps, especially on this right side building, they, they look very good. And also the way the figures blend almost into the background, apart from these little highlights. I think that's all also very good. And the texture. So I got the texture on the buildings from spraying with a water bottle. So I thought this was a very good first attempt. Here's the second one. Now, this is really a sketch, but often my sketches... I know I've called these watercolour sketches, but what I mean is this is a, almost like an experiment and where I'm just trying to like, where I'm just playing and I don't care about the result. And often these ones end up being the best ones because they've got um, a certain vitality to them. Anyway, in this experiment, I was practicing with the architectural details that you can see on the right hand side. So I was having some gaps in the um, in the wash. I was leaving some gaps and I was also doing some white titanium paint or using some white titanium paint to make some architectural details. So I quite like that. And once again, I like the figures and I like the windows I did in the distant building um, that was using titanium white and brilliant orange. And now we're on to the third one and you can see I'm being more serious here and more careful with the drawing and with the details. And I like this too, but I think it's lost the vitality of the previous painting and the one before that. So I like the play of warm and cool, the orange and the blue. And... Um, I do like the building on the right and the details. I think that's that's nice. And I really like the ground and the dry brush effect and the sparkle of light on the ground. I think that works well. And also those power lines going across at the top. So, and the lights, the lights on the right hand side, they look really nice. That's really good. And now for my final painting. So I'm quite happy with this. I think the figures are interesting. And maybe I, I played around. What happened is the left hand side and the distant building were very plain. And then I did a lot of details with this right, right side, right hand side building. And it was too detailed. And so to unite the whole thing, I went over it all again with a wash, but I got a little bit excited, I think, on the left hand side building. And um, I'm not sure, it, it almost looks a bit like graffiti or something. I don't know if you like that. There's a, there's a lot of texture there. I think it's kind of interesting, but maybe too much. And then um, on the right hand side, I think there's still too many architectural details and I need to simplify it even more. So and maybe the building in the distance needs just a bit more intense orange and a bit darker. Yeah, I think I've got to play with my washes more and uh, strengthen them. But I'm still quite happy with it. And I'm not sure if making the figures more detailed and defining them, defining them, was such a good idea. It might be much better to do them like the original painting where they blend into the background. So anyway, 
please tell me which painting you like painting one the first one or the second one or the third one or the last one so me I think my favorite one is probably the second one so that's all and I hope you enjoyed that and bye for now